insights will be Jim Beglin. Hi Peter, always good to work with you. I'm really looking forward to this now. There's the whistle and here we go. Tries to get it forward quickly. Floats one over. Goes for it! Good try. The outcome could so easily have been different. Well, if he hopes to do better than that, he's got to work on his technique and his timing. The contact wasn't right there, so there wasn't much chance of success. Well, that should set them on their way and get into a nice rhythm. The early signs are very encouraging now. Abdenor. Enzo Perez. Abdenor. Enzo Perez. Rodrigo. Aimed long and direct. That intervention was very necessary. He's gone for it! He's missed, but not by that far. Well, when it becomes that speculative, I think it requires something from the very top drawer, and he had to think a little bit more about that. In the end, he's just opted for raw power. Well, this is how to grab a game by the scruff of its neck. Front foot football with real intent. Spoon forward. Abdenor. Still goalless. And it's Rodrigo. Chip through. And that'll go straight through to the keeper. Garner, get it back again. Goes long. Enzo Perez. Abdenor. Enzo Perez. Plays a clever pass. Oh, good interception. Enzo Perez needed to come up with a better ball. I timed this run brilliantly, and I think he has every right to be a little annoyed with, with the passer then, and I think he's letting him know right now about that. Just a little more behind it was needed. defence can get it clear that's good progress he's made on the ball where to next and the finish he's done very well to get to that oh, he made that look really easy Peter but I can assure you that wasn't a, a routine save he had to be very switched on there Away from immediate danger. Now the pass. Some good work on the right flank. Now what's next? It's out for a goal kick. Abdenor pumps it upfield. Enzo Perez. Rodrigo. Goes on a charge down the left. And that is going out for a goal kick.
with a delicate ball. Gets it back. Looks to slip it through. And that'll be the last act of the first half. An engrossing half, but we're still where we started. Nil-nil. Here we go again then. Ghana clearly have been the better side for me. Yeah, I know the score doesn't quite reflect it, but if they go about their game in the, in the same manner as the opening 45 minutes, things really should improve. Long and high towards the flank. Who's going to make this theirs? Guillem Siqueira. Let down by a lack of accuracy. Tries to get it forward quickly. Tries lifting it over. And he's there to hoof it away. This defence is, is wary about opposition pace. So they're just not getting too tight? Yeah, they know that if they, they step up, their, their keeper could get a whole lot busier. Not the worst cross in the world, but still room for improvement. Baragan. nil the score and we're just about done a deeply frustrating game tries a through ball and out to safety ball swung in he's going to have to tune his range finder before the next one Jao Cancelo. Oh, that's clearly not what he wanted to do. Tries the route one option. Pass needed to be better than that, and he knows it. Aimed long and direct. Tries to dink it in. That's going to be a goal kick. Mustafi. Benzo Perez. Mustafi charges in. Some excellent tackling here, and that one a perfect example. Away from immediate danger. Well, that's surely a foul free kick. Clears it out of harm's way. Passes it through. Now here's the through ball. Bento Perez. Guillem Siqueira. And it's Rodrigo. Bento Perez. Into stoppage time and it is still nil-nil. Defence has got rid of that. Aim forward. So that's it. It is all over.
And stalemate. One, if not for fans, then perhaps for coaches. Satisfied by 